Your signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we're going to find out what's coming up for you within 24 hours. Today is the 10th of January, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 11.08 p.m. <laughs> Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Earth Signs and if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same Earth Sign. Okay, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and Angels, please show me for Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus and Capricorn. What's coming up for them within, uh, within 24 hours? Five cups at the bottom of the deck. There is someone or signs. Um, this person has feelings for you, feeling kind of vulnerable right now. Four swords in first. This person has been thinking a lot about you. Two swords in first. It's going to decide to talk to you, to tell you something. I think this person, either they love you or they care about you. They're going to tell you something, some disappointments or sadness. It could be about you or it could be about something else, okay? Hmm. And the Queen of Swords here in reverse. Queen of Cups in reverse and the Three of Wands. Hmm. I feel like the Three of Wands is this person possibly could be longing for you or has been waiting to tell you some something. But I think this is... It's not like a bad news or sad news. I feel like they're, this person is sad about something. You may have a friend or someone, someone that you care about or this person cares about you who is going to pour their, heart, pour, pour their hearts out to you. This person is going to tell you something about themselves that they could be very, very sad about, okay? Something that's happening to someone close to you. It's not you because... King of Cups, most likely this person could be a water sign or could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could also be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. So someone is going to express to you their sadness, disappointments, or regrets about something that could be happening to them in their life. Unless, for some of you, this could actually be someone who could be feeling uh, vulnerable, in regards to you, in regards to their feelings towards you. I think this person, two different storylines, just take what resonates with you. If you do have someone, because we've got the king and the queen here, both are in one first. So I think both of you will communicate. This person will communicate to you about how they feel about you. And you may in turn communicate to them as well but i think you're not going to really tell them exactly though with the queen of swords and lovers exactly how you feel you're gonna tell them a bit but you're not gonna show them all your cards you're not gonna tell them exactly how you feel maybe you just tell them like 10 percent <laughs> and save the 90 percent to yourself because i think it could also be because for some of you, maybe it's you just not wanting to look weak or don't, just don't want to reveal everything to this person. So I'm definitely sensing this person is going to reveal something to you. But I feel like they're going to reveal to you wholeheartedly while you're not going to reveal to them wholeheartedly though. You're going to reveal to them maybe, you know, just 10%, 20%. <laughs> this person could be, uh, again, longing for you, or this person could be living far away from you in a different country. It may not always mean that. Hmm. And then we've got the Three of Cups. For some of you, within 24 hours or longer, don't take the timing to literally because, you know, when it comes to tarot, it's not... Uh, very accurate when it comes to timing and also this is a general reading so what i'm seeing here with the three of cups some of you within 24 hours or more you're going to be celebrating something socializing you might be seeing your friends or you could go on a date 
Um, three of Cups also can indicate some sort of an activity. It can be any sort of activity, but there will be people around you for sure. And Ten of Pentacles here could be in a building. It could be a club, or it could be in a house. Any sorts of building, okay? Definitely indoor. And then we've got the Knight of Pentacles here. I think you're gonna make some new friends within 24 hours or more. Or somebody that you work with, you you, you become a little bit closer to this person. Um, I see you making new friends, yep. And for some of you, the Three of Cups can indicate reunion as well. So you could be reuniting with or, or meeting a family member or few or family members could be one or a few if not it could be just you meeting up with your friends here but you know there's some sort of celebration it could be attending uh, parties a birthday party or just could be a simple dinner as well but definitely again it's like a building inside a building and the knight of pentacles too some of you within 24 hours you may also be entertaining some clients for those of you if you have if part of your job is to entertain certain clients um where you go i don't know how it works in your country but in malaysia i'm from malaysia so um there are a lot of businessmen who don't you know who entertain their clients outside of outside of the the company <laughs> They will actually go out and entertain the clients with drinks and karaoke and whatnot. Get them a little bit drunk and then have them sign like a contract. <laughs> so some of you could be doing that, okay? Not all of you uh, because pentacles can indicate work. So it could be, for some of you, it could be work-related. But this also can indicate family. So it could be family-related as well. Some of you, again, you might be meeting up with your family, family members, um, barbecue, I'm hearing, or just, you know, hanging out, drinking, chilling, socializing, communicating. Yep, let's see a bit more earth signs. Somebody actually requested for me to do more of the 24 hours reading, so here it is. And we've got the Four of Pentacles in reverse, and we've got the Seven of Wands. Queen of Wands in reverse. You may have a friend who's gonna pour their heart out again. I feel like it's gonna tell you something very sad about themselves, okay? That's for some of you. If not, it could be um, an actual lover um, choosing to tell you exactly how they feel about you. But I see you not again telling this person everything because you're trying to be smart about it, right? The Queen of Swords in reverse. Hmm. And then Four of Pentacles in reverse, Seven of Wands here. Nine of Pentacles. Again, they feel like someone is going to open up their heart to you. But you are going to maintain your cool, though, with the Seven of Wands. And for some of you, if a friend... This is another little bit, a uh, little bit different. If a friend was to tell you, it could be anybody. Um, if a friend was to tell you that they've been bullied or somebody did them wrong, I see you fighting for this person or defending for this person or giving this person some advice. Because the Queen of Swords and Rivers can be a little bit like vindictive. Not saying that you're going to be vindictive, but you're going to be, you know, saying something, either giving advice to this to to your friend or to this person saying that you should do this you should do that or you could be helping this person texting this person the other person who could be bullying them something it could be anything but i just feel like you're going to kind of defend somebody within 24 hours or more that could also be a little bit of an altercation for some of you you might be a little bit mean to someone also within 24 hours or more and this person could be um somebody you work with or it could be a friend or friend's friend somebody whom you're trying to protect okay seven of wands the queen of wands in one first seven of pen uh, nine of pentacles and we've got the five of wands in one first hmm. yeah that would be for some of you too, seven of ones and five of ones, whether it's you or this person, but 
maybe a drama or an argument might ensue and you might just, you know, tell, her, tell everybody to quit it. Let's make peace. It could be that. Or somebody might tell you to quit it and don't fight. Don't fight with somebody or don't start any drama with anybody. <laughs> I'm also a Virgo. I'm also an earth sign. Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, and we've got the Justice here. See, I feel like you are going to... You're, you're going to... You're gonna try and again protect someone, defend somebody um, within 24 hours or more. It might be spending some money as well. The Four of Pentacles and Wealth First could be buying, could be shopping, some shopping, buying something. Okay. The Queen of Wands and Wealth First. Yeah, someone is gonna express to you about somebody is who could be disappointing this person. And you're gonna defend this person that's what i'm seeing but for those of you in a third party situation like in a love triangle situation the three of wands here could also be i don't know somebody's gonna tell you that they have broken up or that they've cut off the third party okay and would like to be with you that's for some of you but for some, uh, another group of you earth signs it could just be like you know trying to console somebody here five of cups you're going to console somebody who is sad, going through some difficulties. Yeah, and you're going to try and cheer this person up. Because you're being a good friend here with the Knight of Pentacles. You might invite this person to come to your place or go to a place, a different place for dinner, drinks. Justice. Justice for me, Candy Kate, you know. Some of you within 24 hours or more, you could be signing a contract or approving something, something that is legal, something that is official. Mm. And I feel like it's a good one. It's a good one because Justice and Nine of Pentacles here. It's a good contract or it's a really good uh, agreement. It may have something to do with money, it may have something to do with work for a lot of you. But then the justice also can indicate seriousness uh, or someone trying to make it official with you. If this has something to do with um, your love life, okay? That's just for some of you. Oh, marriage, justice can indicate marriage. Three of Cups can indicate that as well. Engagement, marriage, Ten of Pentacles, proposal, Nine of Pentacles. I know this is like a long shot, but just for some of you, Maybe two or three of you, within 24 hours or more, somebody might propose to you, saying that, you know, they want to marry you or that they want to be engaged with you or take the relationship to the next level or move in with you with the Ten of Pentacles. All right, Earth Science, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, this is your reading, and I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a couple of playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it, uh, check it out if you want to. Second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different, different topics and different questions. But these readings are still new, so they're still relevant because I post them every single day. In fact, I upload them right away once I'm done with all of the readings. So they are definitely up to date. I hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Take care, Earth Science. Bye.